OMG. Welcome back to my channel. So excited you were here. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn and it is Sunday. So I'm outside of the Walgreens bringing you my Sunday Walgreens haul. If you're new and you just found me, so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you and say hello to you. And if you are already subscribed, I appreciate you so very much. Thanks for coming back to another video. Definitely leave me a hello down there so I can say hi to you. So I feel like we have a pretty good week at Walgreens. There could be some issues with stock in store, which that could always be issues, but there's some kind of like deals we've been doing that are on a different deal, but it's the same product. So I don't know if my store's gonna have all of the stock I want them to have. We're gonna find out. But I got a bunch of digital boosters. So let me know what you got. First of all, every account got the spend 20 and participating PNG products and you earn back the $5 in Walgreens cash. That is an online only deal. So you would do that ship to home or curbside pickup if you wanted to do that. Um, I only found a couple, I just did a little quick search this morning. I only found a couple products that were qualifying for it. Gillette razors were one of them. I don't know if in store that means it's going to produce a $5 PNG coupon. Not sure, we're gonna have to wait and find out. Um, I also got a spend 30 on health and wellness, earn back seven. I'm thinking everybody got that one as well. And that does not start until the third. Then I got a spend 30, earn back seven on anything that expires tomorrow. <laughs> I'm like, what the heck? Um, I also did receive a new monthly spend booster. It's spend 30 six times and you earn back $20 in Walgreens cash. So let me know what you got. So I'm gonna work with the spend. Wish we could stack the health and wellness with the spend 30 and seven general booster, but that one expires tomorrow and the health and wellness doesn't start until the day after that. So kind of a bummer, but all right, we're gonna run into the store. If you enjoy the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go girls, some awesome deals. Happy Sunday, we are in the Walgreens and we are gonna do a couple of awesome transactions. First deal I am going to start off with, I love when they bring this deal around, it is the gift card promotion. Certain gift cards, this time Domino's is included, it can change every time. You buy two and you earn back a free $10 Walgreens gift card. Weed at Domino, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of these. The minimum is $15, so I'm gonna have the cashier load $15 on each one of the Domino's cards. And then I'm grabbing this Walgreens cards card. I will have her load $10 on that. Once I enter my Walgreens information on the pin pad, the $10 will be free. I'm just gonna do this in a separate transaction because you have to pay cash for this. Can't use register rewards or Walgreens cash to pay for it. I'm taking it out of my food budget and it makes sense for me to do that because we do go to Domino's. If you don't see a gift card that you would use or that you want to gift to somebody, then it doesn't make sense to do this deal. For me, it does. I get a free $10 that I can spend. And remember, whenever you are using spend boosters, any type of digital spend booster or any paper spend booster, those spend boosters exclude the purchase of alcohol, tobacco, dairy, prescriptions, and gift cards. So no, you cannot buy the gift cards and use it with your digital spend booster. It will not work. So hopefully I'll get a paper spend booster that prints from doing this transaction so I can use it on my next one. And I did, so I'm gonna get my grandbaby some diapers for super duper cheap. These are on promotion two for 21 buy two earn back for a four dollar register reward and we just got three dollar off two digital coupons so i'll pay 18 earn back four uh makes them seven dollars a pack but i'm gonna get them way cheaper remember i'm using my digital spend booster spend 30 earn back seven dollars in walgreens cash well, I kind of figured this was gonna happen, but I had this plan for both of my transactions where I wanted to grab the Axe body wash. It's buy one, get one 50% off. I still have the $7.50 off two digital coupons that we got last week or the week before. 
um, and they're on promotion for buy two, earn back a $2 register reward. They would have been a little money maker, but my store literally only has a one. So that's a bummer, but I think that's probably going to be a common theme in a lot of stores. Next thing I wanted to grab was this Olay body wash. It's in the wrong spot. It's $12.99 and it's on promotion for buy one, earn back a $2 register reward. We do have a $3 digital coupon and what I thought was an Ibotta rebate, but then I realized it doesn't qualify for the scent. That was literally the only one of the Olay indulgence my store had. Uh, my store's almost all out of the Dove hair care. I found two conditioners only. These are on sale two for $8. I don't have any coupons, but they're on promotion for buy two, earn back a $5 register reward. And we have Ibotta rebates for $2 back on each one and a $1 bonus. So these two are going to end up being a $2 moneymaker. Next up, I'm going to grab some Crest toothpaste. So we have $3 ones, $4 ones, $5 ones. They're all on different promotions, but this one is $5. And they are buy two, earn back a $3 register reward. So I'm grabbing these two. They'll total me $10. I have a $3 off two digital coupon. So I will pay seven. I'll earn back a $3 register reward. And then I'm gonna submit over to Ibotta for $2.50 back on each one of them, plus a 50 cent bonus for buying two of them. So these two crests are gonna be free plus a $1.50 money maker. We've got the baggies on sale again. It seems like this has been almost like every other week. Buy one, get two free. My store's not tagged but they'll all be on sale for $2.79, the ones that are included in the promotion. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick up three of them and one will ring up for $2.79 and the other two will ring up for zero. So I always try to stock up on these. Remember we had that one year, what year was it? Was it 2022? Where they didn't run this promotion at all? So now every time it comes around, I'm like, I gotta do it just in case. I like ran out of baggies at that time and I was like, this is not cool, Walgreens. So anyways, so happy the promotion has been going on regularly. And I just needed a couple more dollars, so I grabbed two Snickers bars. They're on sale, two for two dollars. So this is gonna be my first transaction. So the diapers, the crust, the baggies, and the Snickers totals me $35.79. I have the digital spend booster spend 30 but this paper one is spend 35. So that's why I got up to spend 35. So I'll be able to use both of those boosters. And then remember the very first thing I did was I did the gift card deal where I got the two Domino's gift cards so I could get a free Walgreens gift card. Walgreens gift cards work just as if you were paying cash. So you can always use it on a spend deal. So I'm gonna throw in this $10 I got cause that's $10 in free money and helping me get my diapers. So this transaction should turn out to be a nice little money maker. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and do one more transaction. And of course I did switch cards because I have a digital spend booster on that card as well. Same thing, spend 30, earn back seven. I'm gonna go ahead and add the Crest deal to this transaction as well, because it's just an awesome deal. I have the digital coupon on this card, um, and then I'll submit to my husband's Ibotta for rebates back on this. So these will be a nice little $1.50 moneymaker. And the, the Dove shampoo or Dove conditioners I found, I'm adding into this transaction as well. Then I went and grabbed these Chupa Chup suckers. Remember I grabbed these last week, if you caught that video, they're $1.29 each. So five of them is gonna total me $6.45. Last week I did use a 20% off a $30 regularly priced purchase. I don't have a 20% off today and I'm not getting $30 of regularly priced items. So I'll just pay the $6.45, but I'm gonna submit over to my points for $3.57 back for when I purchase five of them. And then I'll submit over to Checkout 51, my rebate reset over there for 32 cents back each. So it's gonna make all five of them just $1.28. All right, my husband's Ibotta account still has CoverGirl eye rebates. Mine does not, I must've done them too many times. So anyways, all cosmetics are buy to get the third free. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab three CoverGirl mascaras. They're priced at $6.00 and 79 cents in my store. So two of them will ring up for seven. 
No, six seventy nine, and the third one will literally ring up for zero. I have people asking if the free one counts towards spend booster. That's why I just wanted to make sure you understood that it does not. It rings up for zero. So thirteen fifty eight for the two of these. We do have a digital coupon, but I'm going to go ahead and use paper coupons for three dollars off. You can't use a coupon on the free item. That's at most stores. Uh, so anyways, I'll pay $7.58 for these three, and then I'm gonna submit over to Ibotta for $3 back on each one. The limit is three, and I will get the $3 on the free one as well. So $9 coming back from Ibotta, which will make these three a $1.42 money maker. Now, if you don't have paper coupons, we did get a $4 off two digital coupon. You could use that if you're mixing it in with the spend booster. I mean, they'd be less than a dollar for all three and they'd probably end up being free uh, if you still have the Ibotta rebates. All right, because I couldn't get the Olay Indulgence or the Axe Body Wash, I had to figure out what I wanted to get. So I'm gonna do this deodorant deal. We have a bunch of Unilever deodorants on promotion for buy four and you earn back a $5 register reward. And they are buy one, get one 50% off. Since I still have my $7 and 50 cent off two digital coupon, it's gonna make this deal worth it for me. So I'm gonna grab two of the Axe sprays. My store's all out of the Axe stick deodorant. Um, and then I'm gonna go ahead to get my four items so I get my $5 register reward. I'm gonna do the men's Dove deodorant. These are $8.79, buy one, get one 50% off. And I have a $4 off two digital coupon. That coupon, as well as the Axe coupon, you would have had to have previously clipped. Now you could actually do this deal a little bit cheaper if you have the um, tear pad coupons, the $2 tear pad coupons. I know a ton of people have found them in different stores for the degree spray deodorant. And I do have those, but um, I haven't picked up Dove men's deodorant in a long time, so I wanted to grab that. So the four of these total me $24.41. After my coupons, I'll pay $12.91 for the four and earn back a $5 register reward. Makes them about $2 a piece, which is definitely not the best deal we've ever had, but mixed in with my booster, it's all gonna work out fantastic. So for this second transaction, I have the four deodorants, the two Crest toothpaste, the two Dove shampoos, the three CoverGirl, and the five Chupa Chups. All of that totals me $62.44. I did build my transaction up. Remember, I only need to spend 30 for my digital spend booster, but I wanted to be able to use Walgreens Cash to lower my cash that I'm paying out of pocket. You can use Walgreens Cash on any spend deal as long as you do it the correct way. And I'll link a video down in the description box where I walk you through how to do that. So I can safely use $20 in Walgreens Cash and I'll still earn back my $7 in Walgreens Cash for spending 30. Now I'm also gonna throw in this store coupon. It's $5 off, which is a store discount that will not count towards any spend booster. That's why I got my total up a little bit higher. And I'm gonna throw in a register reward for $5 as well. Now with that store coupon, I needed to get my total to be able to use $20 in Walgreens cash. I needed to get my total up to $55. I'm at 60, so I'm totally safe. But that store coupon specifically says it's $5 off cosmetics. Now I do have cosmetics in this transaction, but even if I didn't, it would still scan. It will literally scan for anything. You will see on my transaction that it's gonna take a discount off of every single one of my products, not just the cover girl. Now, if you have a cashier that looks at it and says you can only use this on cosmetics, then you need to follow the store's rules. But it, you could just go buy a package of toilet paper and it will scan. I'm getting a lot of cash back from this transaction from rebates, which is awesome. And it's going to turn out to be a little moneymaker as well. Let's head to the kitchen table and go over this Walgreens haul. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with this Sunday Walgreens haul and... A special birthday wish to my Clarkie who turns two years old today. Woo! And a daughter Jean Woo! OMG, I can't believe he's two. Uh, so this turned out fantastic. Oh, Donna just got up, so he's gonna get up. Uh, this turned out fantastic. It was so awesome. So let me go over the receipts with you. I got the first transaction where I did the diapers, the storage bags. Picked up the two Snickers and the Crest. 
So there are my storage bags, the Snickers, um, the two Pampers, and the two Crests. So I used the points coupon that I got in my first transaction. Oh, from doing the gift card deal. Hang on, I forgot to put the gift cards out. Okay, I suppose it doesn't really matter. I didn't even, I used the gift card, so I just had the cashier throw it away because it was zero. But here's the gift card receipt. You can see these two ringing up for 15 and then my Walgreens one ring up for zero. So just so you know, that's how that works. All right, so I just showed you the receipt for all of this. So I scanned the points booster that I had earned or got from this transaction, which was awesome. And I used a $5 register reward. So I used... Um, my two $3 digital coupons came off for the Crest and the Pampers. $24.79 was my subtotal. I used that $10 gift card. So I paid $14.79, but adding back in my $5 register reward, I actually paid $19.79 for this transaction. I earned back $14.35 in Walgreens cash, which was for my digital spend booster of spend 30 and my paper spend booster of spend 35. And my $4 register reward for the Pampers and my $3 register reward for um, the Crest. And then I will be submitting to Ibotta for $5.50 back. I haven't actually submitted this receipt yet. I might wait till tomorrow to see if I get a midweek. But I paid $19.79 and I earned back $26.85, which makes this transaction free plus a $7.06 moneymaker. And I'm always so excited when I can get diapers for my grandbabies for super cheap, but a moneymaker is even better. Then I did this transaction here. Um, again, I really wanted to grab the Olay Indulgence and I really wanted to grab the Axe Body Wash, but my store just didn't have stock. So I switched it up and it still turned out really, really good. So there are the Dove deodorants at buy one, get one half and the Axe deodorants at buy one, get one half. My three cover girl, two ringing up for full price, one ringing up for zero. If you buy three cosmetics, you cannot use a 20% off because even though these are full price, they now all three become on sale because of the buy two, get one free. Um, there's my two crest and my two dove and then my five chupa chups. So I use that store coupon for $5 off the two cover girl um, paper coupons and a $5 register reward. My digital coupon for Axe came off, my digital coupon for Dove came off, and my digital coupon for the Crest came off. So my subtotal was $31.94, and I just used $20 in Walgreens cash to pay for it, so I paid a subtotal of $11.94. But what I paid with the store coupon and the register reward I used was actually $41.94, I earned back $7.37 in Walgreens cash for my digital spend booster. The Catalina machine spit me out my $3 um, Crest um, register reward. And I told you guys this before, the dang Catalina machine printed that $3 coupon and then it beeped like it does when it's done printing. And I was like, oh no, Didn't pr I'm expecting two more $5 register rewards. And the very unhelpful manager is on shift today instead of the one I love. And then it took about 10 seconds and it started printing again. So then I got my $5 register reward for the Unilever, which was for the Dove. And then my $5 register reward for the Unilever, which was for the four deodorants. So I earned back $13 in register rewards. Submitted this receipt to Ibotta where I received back $19.50 in cash or rebates. That was $18 in rebates and then a dollar for the Dove bonus and a 50 cent for the Crest bonus. Submitted to my points for the Chupa Chups and I got back $3.57 and then submitted to checkout 51 for a dollar 60 for the Chupa Chups. So I paid $41.94 for this transaction and I earned back $45.04. So it was free plus a $3.10 moneymaker. So, so awesome. So this transaction was a $3.10 moneymaker. This was a $7.06 moneymaker. Everything on the table was free plus a $10.16 moneymaker. That is so incredible. Now, had I not got the gift card deal, everything still would have been free, which I would have been super duper happy with. So there you go. That is what I have for you today. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much and I'm going to see you again soon.
Bye.